I'm going to talk today about tricuspid var regurgitation imaging. So clinical presentation, common sign and symptom like why spectrum depend on severity on chronicity of regurgitation. In absence of pulmonary hypertension, trust to my cost-fit regurgitation is common, well tolerated, and usually asymptomatic. Other signs like pulsation in neck from prominent V wave in tubular venous pulp, fatigue, exhaustion, and right heart failure. Epidosphenomically, ascites and peripheral edema. Epidemiology, trust to mild tricuspid regurgitation is common and detected by echography in more than 70% of the patients. Consider physiology when chest extend less than or a core 1 cm into atrium. Severe tricuspid regurgitation present in more than 1.6 million patients in USA. 20 to 30 percent of patients with severe left side heart disease have at least moderate tricuspid regurgitation. Etiology, any disease that causes abnormality in tricuspid valve, about the like annulus, left leg, body, and papillary muscle can cause tricuspid regurgitation. Post-transplantation, severe tricuspid regurgitation is occasionally idiopathic. Associated abnormality like underlying cause of uh, the tricuspid regurgitation, left, like when left endocopular chronic lung disease, left inflow obstruction, secondary finding of systemic venous hypertension, hepatic congestion with resultant cirrhosis. Deformation and reduction of valve uh, cause. In primary disease, maxomatous degeneration, one left leg, right, related to uh, rheumatic heart disease, in fact, endocarditis, traumatic destruction of left leg, carcinoid syndrome, cordy tendinia, related to sickening or retraction due to rheumatic fever. Can be divided into primary and secondary tricuspid regurgitation. So, primary usually caused by rheumatic heart disease, absent abnormality, anomaly, carcinoid syndrome, infection, endocarditis, trauma, adrenal trauma, pacemaker lead. Secondary tricuspid regurgitation more common caused by tricuspid regurgitation. Right heart failure of any etiology. In radiograph, AP or PA, we can find cardiomegaly with enlarged right atrium and right ventricle, distension of acicus vein and superior vena cover, cardiomegaly with enlarged right atrium and right ventricle, distension of acicus vein and superior vena cover, filling of retrosthenol, Clear space on lateral view from right ventricle enlargement, lateral finding distended inferior vena cover, filling of retro clear space from right ventricle enlargement. So, this radiograph, AP radiographs, so right atrial, left atrial and appendix enlargement in patients with rheumatic heart disease. This AP radiograph 
So massive cardiac enlargement from right atrial enlarged mass associated with abstinent anomaly. The is degrees from the vasculature, which is a type of finding with this disorder. The endocardial should interface to the right main bronchial. This AP radiographs of mild left atrial dilatation and marked large right atrium. The apparatus left ventricular dilatation is a result of right heart enlargement caused clockwise rotation of the Ganja chamber. CT finding. Non contrast in hand can find dilated of right atrium and right ventricle. Contrast in hand CT can find dilated inferior vena cava and hepatic vein with systolic reflux of contrast. Adjugated CTA. Tricuspid valve can be visualized with appropriate contrast and injection protocol. Retrospective ECG kit allow for functional assessment of right ventricle, including right ventricle volume and ejection fraction. Retrospective gating also assess rapid motion area of mouth, coaptation and commissure to commissure gap distance, which may assist in truncatator repair. Tricuspid part annular dimension and relationship of annulus with right coronal artery and right ventricle, just leave ventricular septal flattening and shift toward left ventricle due to volume overload, dilated right atrium, right ventricle, and systemic vein. Incomplete closure of tricuspid in ventricular systole and regurgitant orifice may be seen better with delayed CT scan. So this CT image, so right atrial enlargement from severe tricuspid regurgitation, the left atrium is dilated and partially calcified from long-standing mitral stenosis. Left blood calcification is associated with rheumatic mitral stenosis. ACT image so dilate dilation of right atrium due to severe tricuspid regurgitation. Now tricuspid while left blood sickening secondary to carcinoid heart disease. This CTA image, so the tricuspid wire reflect in short view during systole, note the recapitation or if I black solid arrow indicated. The CTA image, so right atrial enlargement with mild coaptation of the subtal and anterior tricuspid left blood. Amohai finding. Sign SSFP for chamber. Private decal long axis and sub axis view are most useful. Systolic spine, the passing flow, void chat direct from tricuspid part into right atrium during system. Insult axis plan chat area and abnormalized sign intensity can qualify severity of the tricuspid body regurgitation. The latation of right atrium and right ventricle, dilation of superior vena cava, inferior vena cava, hepatic, and acicus vein plus systolic flow reversal. Chastelic ventricle Subtal pattern toward left ventricle. Calculation of low 
Arrive when the car ejection fraction is helpful in predicting poor outcome in patient with isolated severe trichosplit regurgitation underlying surgery, surgical repair. Pass contrast on all assessed forward pulmonary flow with which can be subtracted from arrive with the cost of volume to quantify trichospid regurgitation. Direct qualification of trichospid regurgitation in short axis is difficult and require complex software for tracking trichospid analysis throughout Kazakhstan. Trichosphere left blood morphology can be associated with breast or, or navigator gated sequence with data throughout cardiac cycle. So this are my image. So the flow across the track bar into right atrium during gestal. This MRI may show the passing flow chat directed from the trichosphere bar into right atrium indicate trichosphere regurgitation. This MRI may show a passing extending toward the posterior right atrial wall suggestive of moderate to severe trichosphere bar regurgitation. This um, I made during Yasto so massive and large of right heart, which compressed to the left atrium and left ventricle. This is my mesomal cooptation of trichosphere in Cisto with regurgitation or refine.
Thank you.